What time I said be inside? Seven. When or what? When she left him off. What happened last week? Five people got shot. What happened a week before that? Dad was shooting up at the gas station. Justin! The way I work is uh, uh, requires a lot of um, intuition and flexibility and immediacy. I need to work with a sense of urgency because whatever is happening before my eyes, I know that it's happening only once. There is no uh, secret to intimacy in filmic terms. There is something that has to do with uh, how open and intimate I choose to be uh, with, uh, with, with my characters. I film very close. Um, we use one lens which allows us to get really close or better said, forces us to be close. I operate the camera at least 50% of the time because Diego Romero and I need to pass the camera onto each other's shoulders so that we can continue filming without cutting. Uh, and I struggled for years trying to find the medium that would really serve our purpose of you know filming continuously giving us this continuum of images and also experience you know and and then and the portability aspect of it so it's quality it's portability durability and uh, and really performance under low light condition the amira have a, the ergonomic for the soldier and everything is it's fantastic and the NDs integrated they make our life very easy because before we had to change all the time. I want to be very, I'm very disciplined with the stop that I'm shooting. I don't shoot more than two eight, never. Because I want the focus going on the characters all the time. So that's for me my main thing. What black and white is giving me this time is timelessness. And it's also equanimity. By that I mean the old stories. Uh, we, we follow different stories in the film, but all the layers are, layers are kind of put at the same level without higher or lower peaks. It was really important for us to, to reach the level or equanimity. We knew that the image was going to be very contrasty, but we also knew that in order to emphasize the beauty of those images, we needed, we needed uh, to capture every single detail. So that translates into, you know, uh, latitude. We make kind of a few rules when you make, when you restrain yourself and saying okay we're gonna shoot with one lens, we're not gonna use any artificial light, we're gonna use only practicals when we need it but mainly the light that comes out of the windows, that's it. So that make a coherent in the narrative which I think is very cinematic and people don't apply on documentaries because people think in documentaries everything is okay, you can shoot with soon, you can shoot whatever and we didn't want to do that. We thought, okay, let's shoot what is beautiful. We always look for something that is beautiful. And I think because even Roberto and me, we, very, we love people. We love to meet people, we love people, we love, we, we find everything, I don't know, beautiful. And we find, we try to find the beautiful things, what we see, it's like, a, I think like a still photographer. know why I'm teaching you how to fight. To protect yourself. Because nowadays, people don't fight. They like to shoot.